Anna Dora. Uh, I'm an Icelandic abstract uh, landscape artist. Um, I've always been fascinated by uh, texture in paintings and I suppose that comes very much from my home country, Iceland. Um, sort of the land of the, the cold and the movement. There's always movement in the weather and that's something that really fascinates me. When I started painting, I must admit, I don't really know what I'm doing. I might be um, interested in um, a, some sort of color combination. Um, but once I start and I get going, it's absolutely, I know exactly, absolutely what I'm doing at each stage. My background is fashion. Um, I've been a makeup artist all my life. Um, so working with color, you know, all, all my adult life. and. Um, um, I must admit, sort of having worked all day, worked hard all day, and uh, the models start washing all your hard work off at the end of the day. A little bit frustrating, I must say. But, uh, but now, obviously, doing the paintings is something that is, um, you know, where I can sort of put something from the heart on a canvas that uh, sort of stays there forever. This painting here I call The Core. Um, I painted this about three months ago. And I suppose that um, coming up to the end of the year, um, you know, with New Year's resolutions and everything, I, I find myself sitting and pondering, how's the year gone? Where has it been? Not just this year, maybe the past. Where am I now? Am I where I'd look like to be? Are my dreams coming true? Am I on the way? Um, so this, I painted um, the core. It's basically bringing everything up. So I painted it as a volcanic mountain, volcanic eruption. Um, where just bring everything to the surface, doesn't matter what it is, bring it to the surface, deal with it, um, see what I've learned from it. Um, and, uh, and then I decided to do this, a lovely glaze over it, almost like a little protective shield, um, so that uh, you know, you're not reliving any maybe uncomfortable, happy, happy, unhappy memories, I don't know. But uh, so that's this one. So what I do with this, I use um, salt crystals um, that, um, burst open so within the next six months they will turn into little flowers that will burst open um, so I like this organic I, li I like this organic free-flowing methods in all my paintings and I must admit I'm a, I'm a little bit of a mad scientist when it comes to my um, studio I love mixing things together trying things out and uh, seeing what happened exploring um, I'm like a little kid and here we have a thawing frost rose um, which is sort of in the collection with the core. Uh, the reason I painted that one, I just wanted it to be almost Christmas future. Um, whereas this was Christmas past, the core, now we have thawing frost rose, which is more of a, a, a Christmas future. So I painted it as a frost rose that's melting and it's basically um, bringing in um, serenity and happiness and softness. So. So it's been melted by the volcanic mountain and it's ease and happiness and, and wonderful things to come. Here we have Chasing Fire, um, got a series of three. Um, this I painted because I wanted to demonstrate, um, you know, when you're chasing your passion, when you're feeling, when you know you're on the right way. And I just wanted to um, show the movement in um, the adventure that is all about the journey and and how you get there it's not all about the end result that's that's what it means to me so you see that wonderful red sort of running through the whole whole collection of these three well this has been my first time at the Barcelona International Art Fair and it's been absolutely fantastic um, the artists have been so you know helpful and kind and it's a real friendly atmosphere which has been amazing so wonderful experience um, and now if you want to have a look at any future um, exhibitions um, please have a look on my website which is um, www.artbyanadora.co.uk so it's been yeah wonderful